Massey is a thick, creamy mass your family will love. Made with love by Clover. It's finally the end of the week and we have a fantastic brunch recipe for you to try this weekend. Clover Amasi, with its creamy texture and rich flavor, is the key ingredient you'll need to make these delicious breakfast muffins. And to get the list of ingredients you need, all you have to do is SMS that keyword uh, to 33650. It is Clover and you can get that recipe sent straight to your device. SMSs cost one rand fifty, and no free SMSs apply. Clem has obviously got all of the magic touch, uh, touches that he puts to these recipes. Sure That's how you've gotten started. I I have. So we're calling these muffins, but essentially the magic is in the batter, okay? Okay. That's where everything's happening. So in here, the bowl already... It's always batter with the batter. It is, eh? Mm -hmm. Yeah, it's lacquer with the batter. Lacquer with the batter. There we go. So we got some <laughs> cheddar cheese, we got some mozzarella, mm -hmm. we got some corn, tin mm -hmm. corn, frozen corn, whatever you got, add the corn in there. And I got some mushrooms. I cooked in like a lot of garlic, like six cloves of garlic. Oh, I yummy. want the flavor in there. The trick is actually the mushrooms, is mushroom, the bacon, all these moist ingredients actually keep your muffins or your batter very, very moist. Yeah. So there's, there's no egg in here, which there's, is... Oh, there will be egg, egg There is an egg, absolutely. So I'm going to go with the flour first. Mm -hmm. And this is self-raising flour, no baking powder, you know what I mean? Just like one less ingredient to work with. And then, Dad, how about you take the words and start at your spatula, start mixing that through. Cool. And as you're doing that, I'm going to add your egg, a bit of a binder Binding in there already. Yeah. So we're making these into, into muffins, right? You can actually pop this in your waffle iron. It'll make the craziest savory waffles. No, gross. No, no clear. Yeah, it is no, crazy. Man. You will not leave your bed really? the weekend. You'll sit there. Remember last weekend you made a fort? You yeah. make a fort again just eating this whole weekend. <laughs> All right? I can't afford that you again. <laughs> no. Uh, so mm. salt and pepper going in. Okay. Then extra ingredients. Oops. We're going to have four cheeses in this muffin, okay? Totally. Why okay. not? Quattro formaggi. formaggi. Here we go. Look at the look at the ketan boy teaching the Italian guy. Oh my <laughs> goodness, I love it. Then cheese number three, feta going in there. Mm -hmm. Some leeks going in, and then bacon, which is rendered. We didn't render the fat out. We want that bacon yes, fat. Okay, yeah, yeah. that's gonna moisture, add moisture, moisture, and big flavor going in there. Usually, muffins you're adding a whole bunch of things like you know butter, etc. Uh -huh. With that bacon in there, it's the oil you need. It is. So this is some olive pasta, like tapenade. Mm. Pesto, like you know, mm. add that in there. That's a bit of zinc. You can use tomato paste for that. Totally Honestly, go crazy. Use a leftover pasta sauce if you didn't use it all. Just you have to be careful. There. Who has leftover pasta sauce? I do. Okay, not coming to yours for dinner. Yeah, it's just in case that extra surprise guest arrives. All right, you know? okay, cool. Then Clover Marcy brings it all together. Okay, you ready for this? Mm, I you, am. You, you're a good mixer, eh? Here's the hero ingredient. You ready? Yep, Here we go. ready for you. So I'm eyeballing this, but I know how much to add. Literally, when it starts making a batter, it comes together nice and thick, we're winning. Clover Marcy also adds a bit of that tang Ooh, to yummy. it, okay? I like making this batter ahead of time, mm -hmm. keeping it in the fridge. It'll keep for about three days. Which is really cool. Wow, that's yeah, really cool. So you sort of for the whole weekend. I kind of like this idea. And also, Amasi itself, everyone generally thinks that you can only really drink it. To be able to use okay. it in something, you know, interesting like this, it's so cool to be able to see, to cook with it. it but is. that always bakes with Amasi, but I've never seen us bake like a savoury dish and like that with Amasi. This is a really, this is, like, you have to try this. Cool. I've also made this into like, pot, pot this in a loaf tin and made a bread out of it. Nice. It's really, really crazy. Yeah, like a pizza bread almost. Yeah, exactly. So you're going to have a okay. roast on Sunday, right? Totally. Cool. Your leftover chicken, butter, and pumpkin, mm -hmm. whatever you have left cool, over, yeah. add that to the batter instead of the bacon and the leeks, and you're going to have like a little leftover Sunday yeah. roast. If I'm honest, this is something you might want to make if you're somebody who's trying to get your fitness back in this sort of winter season. You kind of go to gym, you make these, snack on one on your way to work. If you're rushing around the whole place, you know, it's quite an easy yeah, way to, to do that. That's nice. There we go. So you're wondering where the fourth cheese was. It's actually the parmesan, which you put in the crust at the bottom of your muffin tindica that's lined like that. That's how we can get it out there. Brilliant. Four cheese breakfast muffins done. What Lekker. Do Sounds and looks delicious, and to be honest, even though it's not cooked yet, it smells amazing as well. So, good job. Yeah, Very yeah. quick and easy way to get all of those ingredients and those nice flavors into your system, all in one easy dish. And it's uh, very simple to do. So, if you want this recipe, that keyword is clover, C-L-O-V-E-R. You SMS that to 33650 at a cost of 1 Rand 50, and literally, it'll pop up on your mobile device. And if you need a little reminding of how the steps sort of unfolded, watch this.
Made with love by Clover.